right, so now let me teach you how to play the right hand for the pre-chorus So it goes like this So basically what I'm doing here, I'm going to E minor and I'm pressing it three times This is my middle C So I'm playing the E minor here So uh, when I press E minor, I press it for three times Then I go to F so we were just kids. Okay, so then I go to C, B minor. So okay. So that's E minor three times, then F, then C, B minor, and then I go to C here now, and I press it four times. Well, After I press C four times, so basically after C, uh, C I press B minor and then A minor. So okay, and then I go back to C again and I press it four times. And then after that, you go to D minor. Okay, so after that, you go to D minor, B, then C, then A minor. Okay, so I repeat everything again slowly. continue here then you go so that's basically C B minor A minor then you go C for four times hold then you go then so C B minor A minor B your and your then you go to D minor C A minor E minor and then you go to B minor Okay, or you can do B, uh, G and B minor, like that. Okay, so I'm going to repeat the second part, so... teach you how to play the left hand for the pre-chorus now the left hand for the pre-chorus for the easy version is the same as uh, the left hand uh, in the first verse for the easy version which is just repeating a minor octaves for four times one two three four and then going to f octaves and then we're pressing that for four times sorry octaves and we're pressing that for four times one two three and four and then we're going to E minor octaves and we're pressing that for four times too one two and three and four and three. so for the advanced way it's it's essentially the same but we're going A minor E minor Normal speed. 
need is okay. Then with the F chord, we're doing the same thing. We're playing now between the F and C. So F. So D minor, A, D minor, then A minor, then D minor, then A minor. Then repeat it again. D, A minor, D minor, A minor, and then D minor, then A minor. And then last is E minor. So E, E minor, B minor, B minor, then B minor, then E minor, then B minor. Then repeat again. It's E minor, B minor. is twice but when I play between the chords like E minor B minor I'm repeating it twice too so I play it very slowly maybe um you learn you just have to practice it so basically it just goes like this I'll play it very slowly teach you how to play the right hand and the left hand for the pre-chorus so we ended up here so that I play without uh, anything on the left hand so I'm pre just pressing E minor three times F then C B minor so when I go back to C here on the right hand I press A minor octaves on the left hand for four times Every time I'm pressing C on the right hand, I'm pressing A minor octaves on the left hand. So, okay. so, so B minor, A minor without anything on the left hand. Then when I go back to C here, I'm pressing F octaves on the left hand for four times as well. Again, B minor and A minor, nothing on the right hand. Okay, then we go back to D minor here. I'm pressing D minor octaves on the left hand. So every t I press when I press D minor on the right hand, I press D minor octaves on the left hand. Then when I go to C here, I press D minor octaves on the left hand again. Then when I go to A minor octaves on A minor on the right hand, I press D minor octaves on the left hand. Then when I go to E minor on the right hand, I press D minor octaves on the left hand. Okay, so okay, so I repeat it again. E minor on the left hand twice, then D minor alone, then C alone. And when I press B minor here on the right hand, I press E minor octaves on the left hand. Then when you go, when I go back to C again, I go to E minor on the left hand. Okay. So, okay. So basically, when I'm pressing C here, okay. So. on the right hand, I press E minor on the left hand. Then when I go to down and just, so when I press
press C here, I press E minor again, and jazz, and then I repeat again. C on the right hand, I'm coordinating the A minor octaves on the left hand. Then I go to G, B minor, I press E, mi e minor octaves on the left hand for four times twice, and then you go. press the E minor on the right hand, so I press E minor octaves on that hand, so then I press C here, on the right hand I press E minor octaves on the left hand, then now after that you go to the chorus which is so that's a different part. Okay, so this is that's how you play the easy way of the left hand. So to play the more advanced way on the left, on the right hand and the left hand. So basically, we're going. So basically when I'm pressing C here, I am triggering the A chord, A minor chord on the left hand. So we're going. So when I'm pressing C here, I'm pressing A minor, E minor, A minor. So how I taught you in the left hand. You see how I'm playing it? So you have to know that when you press C on the right hand, you go to A minor. So. So when you press C on the right hand, you press A minor chord on the left hand. So. Okay. Then when I go to C here again, back, I press F now. Okay. So basically I'm just playing A minor, E minor. E minor octaves on the uh, E minor chord on the uh, left hand. Then you go. Then you go back to. So here C again. You trigger the F chord. And then B minor. Okay, so it's a different chord. All right, so now let me teach you how to play the right hand for the chorus. So it goes like this. So that's E minor, C, A minor. So this is our middle C. So I'm starting here. E minor, C, A minor. And then I go. And that's basically A minor, G, F, G, C. So, okay, so A minor, G, F, G, C. Okay, then it goes A minor, E minor, C, C, B minor, A minor. Then I repeat again A minor, G, F, G, C. 
Then I go to. So that's. So E minor three times. Listen to our F, C, B minor, A minor. Okay? So from the beginning, it goes like this. slowly A minor and C. First, I'm pressing A minor twice alone. Then I'm pressing A minor and C. So, so A minor alone twice. Then C. A, then A minor and C twice. So first, I'm pressing A minor twice. Then I'm pressing A minor and C twice. So. And then I'm going to G and B minor twice. So first is A minor and I'm pressing that twice. Then A minor and C and I'm pressing that twice. And then I'm pressing G, mi G and B minor twice. Then I'm pressing F and A minor twice. Then E minor and G twice. So I'll repeat it again. Then D minor and F. So this is D minor and this is F. So D minor and F. One time only. And then I'm pressing G alone. Oh no. 